Taylor Thomas. I'm here with your 8x8s. Eight and we have today... Mia Mugavero. Ooh, she has a big name. M-M. M&M's. Yeah. M&M's. Oh, that's so cool. I never yeah. thought about it like that. <laughs> okay, so tell us a little something about yourself. How old are you? I'm 13 years old. 13. You're officially a teenager. Yes. Do you feel a little different? No. Okay, cool. It's okay. No. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Where are you from? Originally from Chicago, Illinois, but I moved here, LA, a year ago. So in a whole year, you've been in I'm a Beast that entire time? Yeah. And how do you feel about that? I feel amazing. It was literally a dream come true. I remember like back home in Chicago watching like Upgrade You and like Get Me Bodies, like learning those. And then to be here in like I'm a Space, like it's just amazing. And yes. you came at like literally the time that everything started happening. Yeah. So it's really nice to like just see everything be built. Yeah. And you and your mom are here a lot just knowing from experience and being yeah. around you guys. I love you guys. <laughs> How do you feel like having such a good support system at home that's like helping sell merchandise and going to yeah. Bees and things with you? Like how does that feel? It's definitely a great thing to have like when you have support you feel like you can accomplish anything, no matter how big the obstacle is. If you have people behind your back, and especially like I'm a beast family, like if you have your family and your parents and your brothers and sisters, it's great to just, you know, have a support system. Yeah, and your mom's like around so much, she's become our mom. Like, yeah. I go to your mom, I'm like, actually, can you get me a water? Like, <laughs> yeah, my she's mom's here awesome. a lot. Yeah, so if you had to change anything in your experience of being in LA or coming from Chicago at such a young age, is there anything you would want to change? Definitely not getting in my head just because I'm out here mm -hmm. and just working as hard and not losing the hunger as I'm here a lot. Because, I mean, it's been a year, so that's a really long time to be in a new state or city, whatever you want to call it. So to just keep the hunger going no matter how comfortable you are, you could be in your own house and still learn a bunch of stuff. So just continuing to grow. Yeah, that's a good mindset. Yeah. Okay, so you said hunger, and I'm a little hungry, so let's talk about some food. Yes, What's your favorite food? Ooh, I really like beef stroganoff, but like with rice, not like noodles. You got specific on yeah. us. Are they gonna be like M&Ms? <laughs> right, I like Kit Kats too. Beef stroganoff, yeah. well, how do, do you even know how to make that? Yeah, you cook? I love cooking. I mean, I'm not as good as like Sean Liu out there, but I mean, yeah. no one's as good as right. Sean Liu. <laughs> I mean, really. But like, I'm, I love cooking. I like baking too. Baking Okay, fun. so favorite thing to bake? Cookie, cupcake, brownie, Ooh. give it to us. I like brownies because I have like the special recipe where like it's really fudgy, but like on the outside it's like crispy. Oh, it's so good. I've known her for a year and she's never baked me brownies. I'm sorry, Taylor. We're gonna have to talk sorry, about that. Oh my God. Okay. I'll make them. So Mia's gonna make me brownies and yes. then we'll come back to the next one. Yeah. I want brownies next one too. All right. Okay, cool. I got you. Thank you. All right. Love, love you. Love you. <laughs>